All right, guys, today I'm going to be ranking my best snipes of the year with tier lists, okay? So I have a whole bunch of snipes that I got throughout the year. I'm going to be ranking them based on price that I got them for, my reaction for them, and, like, what they sold for. So we've got a whole bunch of cars on there, as you can see. And all these stupid ads on the side of the screen are annoying. I don't know how to get rid of those. I don't think I can. But anyway, so, yeah, we're going to start ranking them. We got S, A, B, and C tier. Um, I don't know if I'm going to use C tier, but I guess we'll see. If not, I mean, we'll just take out the row. But first, starting off, we've got Karolenko, AK-47. So I, I'm going to throw in my reactions to the snipe so you guys can see them. But I did snipe this guy multiple times. Let's go! W! 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 Let's go! Look at my reaction, bruh! Bro! Let's go! Another AK snipe! But it's the second time I sniped this man, bruh! Thank you! Thank you! Alright guys, so my Karolenko just expired. It's time for me to redeem him. Let's see how much he sold for. 388,900. So that's profit. Let's go, man. And I don't know which exact reaction I'm going to put in here. Um, but I know when I sniped him, he was like an expensive card. I'm going to go ahead and I'm put him. Man, I'm trying to think in reference to all these other cards. I'm going to put this in A tier. Because when I sniped him, he was like four, four to, or like three to four hundred K every time that I got this snipe. So. And I was always excited to get that snipe. If you ever sniped him back when he like first came out, he was a great snipe. Next up, we got Dark Matter Radioactive Tracy. Now, this was my first ever Dark Matter snipe, and I sniped him twice. The first time was for 40k, which you'll see the reaction to. And I made two videos about it. How much you pay for your PS5? Like $550 or so. Yo, W's! Yo, W's! Everybody, everybody give me a W! Give me a W! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Yo, what is going on? What is going on? Bro! Is this real life? Am I, am I living? Is this a simulation? Is this virtual reality? Bro, my legs are literally shaking right now, bro. I can't even stand straight, bro. Bro, what is this that I'm seeing on my screen, bro? Bro, I can't, bro. I can't do this, bro. I can't do this, bro. I can't do this, bro. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, bro. I'm shaking. Look. I can't even keep my hand straight. Oh my gosh. Yo, yo, yo. I can't do that. I sniped another Tracy. I just sniped another Tracy right now. Oh my gosh. Bro, I was listening to music and I just sniped another Tracy. This one's for 100k. This two. And then I got him another time for 100k. Like, I think it was the next day or like two days later. And it was just crazy. So, this gotta be S tier. It has to be S tier because, like, just the price that he was going for. He was going for like 600k when I sniped him. And I got him for 40k. You guys saw this. You guys saw this. The 40k one was on stream. The other one wasn't. I think the 40k one. I, I think the 40k one was on stream. And this was a historic snipe for me because I always happen to snipe Tracy every year that they come out with his card. Next up, we got Goat Kareem. I don't even remember when I sniped him necessarily. I have to look at my screenshots if I have the screenshot for it. But I know I did snipe him. So I may not have the video clip for it. I'm going to give this an A tier. And you say, how is... Uh, radioactive tracy a better snipe than the kareem because when i sniped the kareem he, he was already down in value it, it was after the goat packs came out it wasn't like when he first came out right or when did he first come out what content drop was he did he come out with the goat packs i don't even remember what what content drop all i know is that when i sniped him he wasn't as expensive as when he first came out like you're growing like i show speed of course Dubby's in the chat! Dubby's in the chat! Let's go! <laughs> Finally, man! I remember when I missed him, he was like 600k, 500k. When I snapped him, he was like two to 300k. I don't really remember exactly what it sold for, but you know, it was a good snipe. It's still a good snipe. We're gonna go A tier. Then we got Goat Kobe. Oof. All right, I have to go S tier on here. The reason I have to go S tier is because go kobe his price did drop but when i sniped him he was like 600k 
now i could have sniped him when he first first came out and he was going for like eight nine hundred k and i wasn't able to do that but i still sold him for like 600k my reaction was probably my craziest reaction ever for for a sniper this year screaming where to the point where i lost my voice for multiple days because of the screaming that you know i did after i got that snipe so that's a s tier snipe oh let's go Then we got Go MJ. Go MJ. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to give this. I want to say S tier, but I I'm gonna go A tier. I feel like it's on the verge of being S tier, but I'm gonna go A tier. The reason I'm gonna go A tier is because every time I sniped him, he did sell for around 400k or so, and so like that's great obviously but i feel like these guys that are in the s tier these guys are like 600k right so it's like yeah you know i don't really want to put him in s tier and i did get him multiple times he was kind of kind of a frequent snipe to pop up to none on the stream the pc's back w is in the chat w is in the chat guys yo yo oh my gosh get timestamp 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 2110 2110 next we have idols joel Embiid. i'm gonna give this one s tier the reason why i give this s tier now he doesn't go for as much as the guys in the s tier but i'm gonna give him s tier because i got him for 800 mt oh my gosh i got him beat for 800 mt bro look at the guy's price man he, i remember i seen this man and for 600k on stream i sold mine for like 200 something k on my main account let's go ahead and check his price bro bro that's gonna set us up nicely bro look at this guys 340k with 30 minutes left like out of all the guys here that i sniped on this tier list this is the cheapest one and this was on my no money spent account for that one video building a full invincible team from scratch and i got him for 800 mt sold him for almost 300k just because i got him for 800 is the reason why he's s tier if i got him for 100k he would probably be b tier but the 800 gives him like that puts it up there invincible lebron easily easily s tier easily my greatest snipe my yeah my greatest snipe of the year was this right here Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Bro! Bro! I got him! I got him! I got him! I got him! Oh! 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 Guys, we're about to redeem LeBron James, okay? Let's see how much he sold for. One point, basically 1.2 mil. This is 199,000. Let's round it up to 1.2 million. I got him for 100k, guys! I bought him for 100k, sell him for 1.2 mil. I'm currently at 2.7 million MT before I even redeemed this. I was actually rethinking it for a second because I was going to say go Kobe. The reason why LeBron is my best snipe of the year is because he sold for more than any other snipe that I got throughout the year. And I got him for 100k, sold him for 1.2 million. You guys know that. If you didn't see that, that was in the i think it was in the 10 million mt in a week video where i got lebron I'll, I'll i'll correct myself if i'm wrong but uh i think it was in that video and then we got invincible joel Embiid. i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna say this one was man am i even gonna use b tier bro uh should i put joel Embiid in b tier i think i guess we'll put Embiid in b tier he might be the only B tier. Now that I'm looking at those cards, I think he might be the only B tier. But the reason I'm gonna put in B in B tier is because he wasn't going for super expensive. I don't even I don't even think he was like 300 k when I sniped him. But the, in the fashion that I actually got him was pretty interesting. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of this. We're not gonna use C tier. Um, like in B, I got him while I was searching for a scroll on the enabled all filter, and I wasn't really trying to snipe him. It was just looking for a scroll, like looking for scrolls, and he ended up being there, right there at the perfect moment. So I just got him. 
No, I just got a Joel Embiid! I just got a Joel Embiid checking scrolls! I just got a Joel Embiid! Oh my gosh! Bro, I was checking the center Atlantic scroll 100k, bro. And I got a Joel Embiid. And I made profit off that. Next up, Invincible Giannis. I sniped him multiple times. I want to go S tier because of how good this card is. It's probably the best card on this list. Either him or go Kareem. But... I never, like, sniped Giannis when he was, like, 500, 600k. Anytime I sniped Giannis, he was, like... I think the most expensive Giannis I sold was, like, 400k. So, I know you guys might disagree with this. I'm going to put him in A tier. I don't know why I moved Jordan to the side. I'm going to put him in A tier. Because I never was able to sell Giannis for, like, 500k. But he is a great card. But, like... I don't know, man. You might say... But the Giannis knife was better than Embiid, but I only was able to see one Embiid, and Embiid is so rare. Giannis is, like, more, more frequent, I feel like. W's, guys! Bro, I messed up on Giannis, and I sniped him on my no money spent! I was hard scoping him all day! Well, today I just started hard scoping him. Oh my gosh! Bro, my heart is racing! Next up, Invincible KD, easily A tier, I mean S tier, excuse me. I did snipe him, I think just once. I think I only sniped this card once. I've seen him a couple times. Sniped him once, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong, but the most, like, I remember sniping him, like, so vividly. I was wearing that basketball jersey that night, and I didn't even have good lighting in my room. And I had to scroll past the 2D Roses, I think it was, and he sold for 950k, so... This was, oh my gosh, such a great snipe. There's no story in there. W's, guys! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> yes! 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 Next, we have Paul George. I'm gonna give Paul George A tier because I sniped Paul George like two or three times and. He was going for more than even Giannis was. So I'm going to give him an A tier snipe. Um, That was just pretty good. Nothing too crazy with Paul George. Where can I join your Discord? You can try the... <gasps> W's in the chat, guys! W's in the chat! Yo! 147.15 is the, is the timestamp. Let's go! Next up, I'm going to go Invinci or Invincible Tracy. I'm going to also give this A tier. I want to give it S tier. But I think the in, I think the radioactive Tracy snipe was actually more crazy. Actually, you know what? I gotta give it S tier. I think I think at the time he was going for five six hundred k. But the thing is, I never sold this card. I kept him because this is my favorite card in the game. So I kept him, bro. Oh my gosh! Let's go! 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 Next up, MPJ. Oof. Okay, MPJ, bro. I'm gonna give this a. I'm gonna give this an A tier. Like you probably think I'm stupid for giving him A tier because you say he goes for over a million MT now, and that's true. He does go for over a million MT. But when I sniped him, he did not go for a million MT. When I sniped him, I sniped him twice, and both of the times he went for like 400, four to 500k, and mine only sold for like 400k. I would check his price right after I sniped him. And I would see him going for like anywhere from four to like 700. And then mine would always sell for like 400. So, yeah, I'm going to have to give him an A tier. But if you get him today, that's easily S tier. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Bruh. Bruh, this is my first ever MPJ snipe. Let's go. I missed him like three times before I finally got him. Next, we got point guard Giannis. And this is the last one. I'm going to give this one, I want to give it an S tier, but I'm going to give it an A tier as well because I don't think it sold for much more than the Invincible Giannis, and this point guard Giannis did sell for maybe around 400k, and it was really crazy. The craziest part about this night was that I had to scroll past so many cards to get it. Talk to the people I care about. No, W's in the chat, guys! W's! W's in the chat! W's in the chat! Let's go! Let's go! Um, so that was really exciting. I was so scared when I saw the card pop up. Press these videos on the screen if you want to see the full videos to some of these snipes. Also, consider subscribing if you enjoyed. Peace out.